This is a small glow plug engine. It's made to operate on uh, ethanol and castor oil. And in this glow plug engines are always a glow plug like this one. Um, and in this circuit I want to show how to make a glow plug modulator. In fact the circuit resembles the earlier circuits that I have showed uh, in the preceding video. But this circuit was developed for 12 volt. A 12 volt lead acid battery. And um, the point is with these glow plugs that they need a lot of current. For instance they need one ampere to, uh, to light up and make the engine start. So that's why I choose a Darlington now, consisting of a power transistor, the 35.5, and a medium power transistor with a high current amplification, the BD139. So now it's possible that with a relative small uh, voltage you can create enough current to uh, let the glow plug glow. This is the circuit transistor mounted on a very good heatsink. I took a car lamp as load because the glow plug burned out a few minutes ago but I'm sure this will work well. I'm now going to turn the potentiometer and you can see that we can make approximately 2 ampere in this circuit. So enough to make the glow plug function to ampere. It will glow on approximately 800 milliampere as far as I know. Uh, when you make an experimental circuit this is also a good way to make a fuse. Uh, two small brass nails and a very small copper wire between it. This accumulator is absolutely able to uh, uh, let this fuse blow and don't spend money on uh, fuses. But always use a fuse here in the circuit. It's absolutely necessary because an accumulator can give a huge amount of current. So you need protection against the too high supply current. These are the pin connections.